you know, after looking at the tape, um, you know, there's, uh, I, I feel, you know, obviously uh, happy with the results, found a way to win the game. We know it wasn't perfect by any stretch. We made uh, plenty of mistakes, but, um, you know, we got to learn from them and, and move on uh, because this football team we're getting ready to play, obviously, is, I think, uh, is ranked number one in the AFC right now. So, you know, that's, that's obviously uh, going to be a huge challenge for us. Yeah, I don't want to place any number on it. You know, will he get more or less, whatever. We'll just be, be smart with him. We'll be smart through the week as well. Um, you know, we're not going to, we're not going to overdo them on the practice field. You know, we, we need them healthy, uh, and recognizing that he's had a lot of time off, hasn't, hasn't done a whole lot of football activity. So, um, you know, we got to balance, balance that. Obviously we all want to get him on the field, you know, for the entire game, but I don't know if that's the, uh, the best thing for him and for our football team. No, it's a possibility. I thought Corey White actually played well for us. You know, when we moved him outside the corner, he gave up the one, you know, jump ball, but they threw, I think, three or four of them, and that kid 15 is a really good receiver over there. So I, I, thought he, I thought he played pretty good over there considering he had no work, you know, on the corner. Um, but th so we can, we can put him at corner or we can put Corey at, uh, at safety and, and definitely move Seymour over there. Uh, you know, I, I think he has that kind of ability. Well, I think we're running the ball down down there uh, effectively. I, I think our quarterback comes alive. You know, obviously going in the game, we weren't the plan wasn't to run Tyrod as much, um, but he's you know running for first downs and touchdowns is okay. Um, so down there, it's hard to defend, and and some of those runs you you make it go eleven on eleven football, and uh, you know because usually a defense can outnumber you. But when you when you you know run the ball with your quarterback, uh, it balances it out. Yeah, it's you know you feel terrible for him because of the uh, I know how hard that he's he's trying to get back and how much he wants to get back and help this football team and and it's tough to see him show up in the condition he's in. Um, but I think you know you got to be patient. We'll see when he's ready to get back out there. We'll put him out there. Well, he'll still be, you know, I know he's being evaluated by our medical staff, but I'm, I'm certainly hopeful that he's out there. I haven't thought about that. You know, we're just trying to find a way to win. And, uh, but I haven't, you know, we, we know our backs are to the wall regardless of who we play. So, you know, they're going to get our best shot one way or the other. But I don't know if it's, you know, extra motivation that this team's got this record or whatever. They got that record because they earned it, um, but no, we just we're just going out there because we need to win, and that's uh, so whatever that takes. That's you know we're going to give them everything, you know. So we'll see if it's good enough. Right. Uh, you know I, I don't. They, they got a right to say whatever they want, but I don't know. Uh, you know any play that jumps out at me, I, I you know I, I can't think of any. Well, I think you got to give that front a lot of credit. I mean, they, uh, you know, they, we had, um, you know, it wasn't just like one player was beating us. It was, it was a few issues there. Uh, it wasn't like we turned people loose. They just, you know, people were, were, uh, you know, were winning one-on-one -on -one matchups. So, um, you know, you got to give them a lot of credit.